Hey, welcome back. Another episode of Cooking with the Kids today. Today we're making meatloaf. Easy to make, always wonderful to eat. On the side we're going to be doing some stuffing, some green beans. You know how it goes. Got my chefs here today. I got Chef Victoria. She got her cat whiskers on. We got Chef Lucas here. And we got baby Chef Liam eating his Cheerios. So what we got here today, like I said, we're making a classic meatloaf. It's going to be easy and very tasty here. Classic meatloaf. Classic meatloaf. All right, so we got our we got about two pounds of ground beef here. I got a half a cup of Italian Wait, breadcrumbs. Classic meatloaf. That means class. That's right. And then I also got about a half a cup of saltine crackers. Also, we got one egg and one onion that we're going to add to the meatloaf. So what we're going to do is we're going to take all of our ingredients here, we're going to add it to our meat, and we're going to mix that up. And then I'm going to add a little bit of sauces in there to put a little bit of moisture in the meat here. That's what we like. We need it. We don't want it to be burnt and all dry in the middle. You want it to taste good and have a little bit of moist. Let me go ahead and we're going to go ahead and start, go ahead and put that egg in there. And let's go ahead and start adding stuff in. Go ahead, Lucas, go ahead and dump your bulls all in there. And then let's go ahead and dump the onions in as well, guys. Go ahead and dump all the stuff inside the meat so we can start mixing it up. And what we're going to do here, we just dump everything in here. And then we're going to go ahead and we're going to mix that up. We're sitting here, we're going to keep mixing that up. We're going to add a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. And then I'm going to add a little bit of Worcestershire, just a little bit of barbecue sauce in there to help add a little bit more flavor to my meat. As I'm waiting for that, I'm going to go ahead and preheat my oven to 400 degrees. We've done this before here. We hit the bake, go up to our 400, bake, and we're going to go ahead and let that preheat. We're going to have one pan ready. That way, whenever we do make our meatloaf, it's going to be, that's the pan we're going to cook it in here. So... Like I said, always when you're doing your meatloafs, make it how you want to make it. It's how we all want. Whatever you like to put in it, you can put in it. You can put a little bit of flavors, garlic, you can put some parsley. Whatever you want to, that you're going to like, that's how you can make it. Here we go. We're going to go ahead and get ready and start forming our meatloaf here. And I will we'll be on the way. So we're going to go ahead and put a little bit of barbecue sauce in there. And then we're going to go ahead and add a little bit of the Worcestershire as well. Or however you say it. That is one of them that is very hard to say. Let's go ahead and just dump a little bit in there. That is good right there. Let Lukey do a little dump. Oh, Lukey's going to do a little dump there. Chef Lukey's getting in the action. Now that we got everything mixed up really good in there, we're going to go ahead and we're going to form our loaf. And we're going to get it on our pan. We got our loaf in there. Looking pretty nice here. We're going to add a little bit of barbecue sauce on the top. And we're going to spread that all the way across. You want to get milk in there? Yeah. We'll help you out, buddy. Perfect. We're just going to put a little dab of that on there. And then we're also going to go ahead and put a little dab of ketchup on there. And then we're going to go ahead and that's that's a good coat on the top that we're going to put on oh, here. Howie. All right. Perfect amount. Just like that. And then we're going to go ahead and spread that all over the meatloaf. All right. Now that we got our ketchup and our barbecue sauce on the top of that, we're going to go ahead. We're going to... Get our hands all cleaned up here. That way we can wipe all them juices and all that sauce off. So like I said, meatloaf's an easy one to take time to prep. It takes about 10 minutes as long as you have all the ingredients ready that you're going to cook with. Preheat our oven to 400. We're going to wait for that to preheat. We're going to cook this meatloaf. We're getting soaked. That's okay, boo. That's fine. He can use that to wash his hands. No problem. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to cook that for about two hours. And then we should be ready to eat. We're going to cover it up with some aluminum foil. About the last 10 minutes or so, we're going to take that aluminum foil off, add some more ketchup and sauce on the top, and then we're going to put it back in and let that crisp up for us. And uh, I hope you guys always like, subscribe. We're going to be doing this. We're here. We love making food. And we hope you guys enjoy watching us make food. Again, our chefs today, they're doing a good job washing their hands, cleaning up on the stove, and eating Cheerios. Hope you guys enjoyed the show. Thanks for watching. And there it is, folks. New ropes and green beans and stuffing. Hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget, like and subscribe.